Good morning, I'm Chrissy the Scottish Magpie. It's Sunday today, so we're gonna go to Errol Market to see how we get on. Um, I wasn't actually gonna go today, but everyone was still sleeping in the house, so I just thought I'd get in the car. It's like, oh well, a couple of hours, what harm can it do? Let's see how we get on. So I'm spoiled for choice today, if you can see behind me, it's so busy, it's on the field. So I just went to one car there and got a plate uh, and like a scroll and like they're, they're, like there's more cars coming onto this field so <sighs> I'm just going to go on to the normal but because there's just so much it's fun day already Okay, we are back home and this is the bundle that I got. Uh, six items, but one I'm keeping for myself. It's just a reference book, so five items for resale. £20 spent in total. 
this is what I've got for myself. It's just a glass reference book. The history of glass. Okay, so the first was this. It's a painting on leather. I believe she's Persian. It's lovely, like a scroll. But yeah, genuine leather. And I got this for a pound. And I got this for a pound. It is Noritake Kukapara. Hand painted birds. Nice plate. So I think, um, I don't know, 20 to 30 for that. And 20 to 30 for that. I also got this mink um two tail it's like a shawl and i got this for two pounds a little sticker in there and oh, the tails are definitely real the fur is real but i'm not sure about the head so i don't know but it's got um like a clasp down there and it's got this threaded kind of thing there, which you would attach. So, I'm not sure about that one. The next one I got is this. You'll maybe remember the two blue faces plaque that I got. I saw this on a lady's stall and I was like, oh my lord, how much is that? She wanted two pounds for this. So this is Devotion by Masca um, and it's the Greek two heads again but this um, is probably maybe again 20 to 30 pound item so and then the book and then this table was 10 pounds so it's got like the big bulbous legs I'm trying to eat, like angle the camera so you can see it properly. So, and it it kind of pulls out. So it goes like that. So it makes it bigger. But the construction of this is really unique. So this comes off, and that's the base. And let me show you the construction I mean it's really really good and it's all um, like if you if you look in there no, it's, it's, it's like the it's like wooden pegged rather than um, you know like any metal wear or hinges or anything. This is a really nice old piece and you've got the flat screw there so and then up there. I think that's the only metal on there so everything else is wooden. So yeah, got this for a tenner. Super happy with that. I think it's early 20th century but I'm not great with furniture. I'm not great with wood. I don't know. I'm not entirely sure. So if anyone knows, let me know if you're better at furniture than I am. I would probably, I mean, I'm, I'm okay sending things this size. And I I can send things pretty much. I've sold like, a, like an arts and crafts chair before. And I was able to parcel that away. Um, so yeah, I, I could send this quite easily. I would charge maybe 20, 25 pounds for shipping to the UK. Um, but yeah, I would probably want 80 pounds plus for this. I've got to do some research, but um, the legs and the construction is what sold it to me. I thought it was really unique. So sorry, my lighting's not great today. Um, but yes, I will be uploading again soon. So make sure you subscribe so you get notified. Thanks for watching. Bye.